Today we're installing an Ag Leader terminal in our Massey Ferguson S Series tractor. If you watched our video titled Locating the Serial Connector in an S Series tractor, you will have already located and pulled out the RS232 serial connector. For this particular install, we will need to use a null modem to connect our terminal harness to the serial connector. Next, I've already installed the two required terminal harnesses in, into our Ag Leader terminal here. Um, so those will need to be connected as well. Finally, in the rear right of the cab, we'll connect our power harness to supply power to our terminal. Now that our connections are made, We'll walk through the settings on the Datatronic 5 terminal in order to send GPS using our Massey Ferguson Gag receiver to the Ag Leader terminal. Once our terminal home page is loaded, we'll swipe over to the map screen. Next, we'll choose the satellite icon, followed by the correction source here. We're inside a shop, so it shows as invalid. We have our correction signal selected. In order to send this signal to the Ag Leader terminal, we'll choose the NEMA button here. Our baud rate needs to be 115,200. Under data format, we'll select GGA, VTG, and ZDA. We want to make sure the transfer rate is at 5 Hz for each of those data formats. Next, we'll move our machine outside to verify signal on the Ag Leader terminal. Now that we've moved outside, you can see on our Ag Leader terminal that we have a GPS signal as provided by our MF Guide receiver 